Yes, the 84980. Yeah, let's translate. And we did agree on the fact that we can transfer because we have got enough funds. Yes. Okay, wait, is it on the Yes, we can transfer it. And can we, the transfer take place between the chaser trust and the business? Okay. The transfer. And then we can transfer the whole amount of 8490. We just change it. Transfer it. I must also transfer it, go ahead, take it to the here on this side. And then you say purchaser business and transfer. And then how much? Eight nine? Eight four nine eighty. Nine eighty, thank you so much. Um and then what else must I do? Uh also effect this transfer in the business cash book and trust cash book. I like that. So I'm going to start there. And obviously, I'm going to write business. Let's come here. that you remember the two steps okay okay that we did and then so far it means we you're okay with this one it's okay it's okay it's okay and then okay let's see we paid this guy was what belongs to him now we can come and pay this guy remember the size are not equal no, we don't have to pay this guy. We still have to do something now. Okay. Now, because now everything has been done, now we need to make sure that we give the seller what belongs to him. Can you see now? So obviously, the whole amount of how much? The, the selling price was how much? Two million. 2 million. Okay. So it means now we must do the transfer between the trust and the seller. So we must take from the trust and give the seller how much? That 2 million. Two million. Does that make sense? Yes. So what we're going to do, obviously, if I take from the purchaser, I will have to come here on the debit side. And we okay. give the seller where? On the credit side. So here I can just come here and say, purchaser, because this act comes from the purchaser. Can you see now? Yes. How much? Two million. Two. Okay. And then this must be, must also be taken out there because I can't just say we got that money now. Uh, huh? so the seller. Seller. Mm, trust. How much is it? Two million. Two million. Does that make sense? Yes. Remember, this money is this money. If you can say 200,000 plus 1.8 is 2 million, this must be given to the seller. We gave to the seller. We took it out. Now we go and increase. Sorry, I made a mistake here. This was supposed to, the arrow here was supposed to go up because we're giving here. Can you see now? Because they've got the same rules. They are both liabilities. Can you see? Yes. So, we did transfer this amount.
I know someone is supporting us here. Yeah. <laughs> uh, no, but we're almost there. Don't worry, we're almost there. The fact is, we're gonna win. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. Mm. So yeah, so that is the amount we took it from there. We took it from there. So again, remember it was the between the two trusts. So we must also show it in the what? In the box. Trust. Okay. Yes. Can you see that? Okay. Um. Let's see. Let me just wanna double check something before we continue. Just let me just make sure that everything is on point. Mm. Want to make sure. So, if you've got any other question, even for time being, because I'm still checking something, you can ask. Let me see. Okay. No, I think all is well so far. All is well so far. Okay, this is what we did the transfer. So that's why there's something called trust generally. Eh? It's when you transfer from trust to trust. Can you see? Yes. So tra uh, trust generally is trust to trust. Transfer generally is trust to business. That's the difference. Okay. So now we need to come and balance these accounts. Let's, which side is the biggest, obviously? Um, which side are looking at the purchase of trust? Yeah, let's look at it. Just give me the biggest side. This one, eh? Just edit quickly. Um, which one are we adding? Up the purchase of trust credit side, eh? 200,000 yeah, plus 84980 plus 11812. Plus three thousand eight hundred gives you two o eight eight seven eighty. Two o eight eight seven eighty. Like this. Yes. Two o eight eight seven. Yes. Okay, that is the biggest side minus the other side. Um, eight four nine eighty plus one is 284980. 284980. Nine. No, just double check this total once again. Double check. Okay. I think maybe you made a mistake somewhere. Yeah, I think I put a deposit. So, because if you say two, this is two million. Eight. If you add, just double add these figures once again, these four figures. Uh, 208480. 208480. Yeah. 980. Yes. Okay. Mm. Find the difference with that. So we're gonna have a new difference. Oh, what's happening there? No, I think it's just a network. So now it's two oh eight four nine eighty minus two eight four nine eighty. Um gives you one point Hmm. What's going on? Let's see. It's two o eight four nine eighty. Okay, wait. Let me no. do it again. Two hundred thousand plus eight four nine eighty plus one point eight two three four five plus three thousand 
800 gives you 2088780. Yes, I was right. So minus the two figure, minus 84, minus two, two million. Yes, okay, so now what do I do? I, I minus it, 0.88780 minus 2.84980. The answer must be 3.8 because I can, I'm checking both sides. If you find the difference, the answer must be 3.8. Okay. Yes, it's two o eight four nine eighty on the credit on the debit side. So on the difference. Uh, okay, so now you say two o eight eight seven eighty minus two o eight four nine eighty gives you three eight hundred. Yes, I wanted that amount. That's why it was too much for me when you gave me those millions. Oh, okay. Can be the so this is what we need to pay our uh, purchaser from the trust cash book. It's 3.8. And if you remember, this is the amount that was coming from the interest. Can you see now? Don't you remember the interest? Yes. This. So if there was no interest, this book was supposed to balance automatically if there was no investment at all. Okay. So I must take this to the trust book on the credit side, and I just say purchaser. This three eight hundred is known as. No, this is just a, a, the payment to the purchaser. What we owe him. Okay. We can just say settlement, maybe payment. Let me just say settlement. Okay, settlement. Usually we don't have to pay the purchaser anything because the purchaser is the one who who is buying. Né? The reason why we, we owe the purchaser in this case is the fact that we invested money and he earned
Sorry, I had to restart my laptop. You. That's okay. I'm still here. Yeah. No, it's okay. I don't know what's happening. It doesn't happen like this. I don't know. Maybe it's the network for the area. I don't know. But hopefully it will be okay. Um, let me just put it one again here. Yeah. Now it's, easy. Now it's, it is even much, much, much faster. Uh, we were here. Let me know when you see the... the projection here. I can see it now. Yes. I was saying before we were disconnected, ne? I was saying usually yeah. when you balance this, this purchase trust, ne? remember this is the buyer. Usually we don't have to pay buyer anything. Buyer is the one who must pay us. Yes. But there are some exceptions. Why? Because the reason why we here we ended up paying the buyer something is because we invested his money and he gained interest. This represents the interest, if you can check. Okay. Can you see now? If there was yeah. no interest, this book was supposed to balance automatically. This side okay. of the debit side was supposed to be the same side, uh, the same as what the credit side. I'm just yes. saying in future, when you are balancing and you don't have anything to trust cash book here, don't think that you are wrong. It's because there's nothing that the purchaser gained from the process of selling. Here, the purchaser gained because of the interest. Okay. Yeah. Uh, remember, this one is balanced. This one is balanced. This one is balanced. This one's balanced. This one is balanced. This one, you don't have to balance it. Uh, this one, if you balance it, usually, again, when we deal with the conveyance in here, the sides must automatically balance, meaning they must, okay. uh, no, they, they must not automatically, but the difference must be paid to the seller. It means it will be balanced completely. But this okay. one, the fact that there was an agreement, remember there was an agreement about the proceeds? Yes. So that's why here we'll end up having a balance for the seller. Usually the balance will be called trust cash book. Meaning here, where, where I said trust cash book, I was supposed to have the difference between the two sides. Unfortunately for this seller, we, we are going to have what you call what? Balance? Carry down. I don't know if it makes sense. Okay. So meaning we must add this the 5 million plus 2 million is 7 million eh? and yeah. something. 7 million. 7 million. And twenty-four thousand. Is it like this? Five two two four and three zeros. Five thousand plus two, two million, million gives you seven or two four. And no, three no, it's zeros. Five plus seven million some seven what? Just spell it for me. Seven oh two four and three zeros. Oh thank you. Yes. Thank you so much. So meaning that is the total there i must also put it this side and the difference between the sides you just have to minus the other side so minus 2 million minus 24 million is going to be something like 5 million and what and 24 something like that if i'm not mistaken five million five only. it's five million only eh? Five or two four. Yeah. Yes. Five or two four and three zeros. Why are we having okay, maybe I'll double check. Because I thought we are minus in twenty four. We are minus in twenty four. Why are we still having twenty four here? Okay, let's, let's just check. Do you understand what I mean? I think it's five million five million without zeros. Double check for me. If you Maybe add I'm up wrong. the 5 million from the, and the 2 million, you get 7 million and on the credit side now. And then plus 24,000 is 7024. Then on the credit side, we're adding 24,000 to the 2 million. Remember, I want the difference between the sides. This side is the biggest. Yes. It's 7 and 24. Yes. 7 and 24. So 7 and 24 minus this 2. How much you get here? 
Yes, this is the balance carried on. I think I'm correct. Yes. Yes. Because you gave me 5024 here. That's why I said yes. no, it can be. Yes. Okay. Yeah, because the total here is 2 million and 24. Okay. Yes. And then you just have to see balance brought down. Eh? Don't forget to bring yeah. it down yes. all times, which is going to be how much? 5 million. So usually when we do these books, we don't usually have a balance carried and balance brought down. We have this because of the special, of, remember the instruction that was given to us. They only wanted 2 million. Can you see now? Yes. So if there was no instruction, we were not supposed to have balance brought down because the whole amount will be paid out of trust cash book. Okay. Yes. Okay, so that's... And then we can also balance this one. But again, this one will still have a balance. Why? Because we didn't pay the seller what the seller was supposed to be paid. So again, the same procedure here. And then where you just have to check the biggest side. And then obviously the biggest side, I think it's going to be this one. Yes. So then they say, so then that squares off everything. It's, we completed everything now for convincing. Yes. Now uh, they wrote, calculate trust liability after completion of your mandate. 1.3.2. This one? Yes. They want to know how much do we owe the seller, the liability. This is the answer. We owe the seller how much? 5 million. This is what they meant. They should have said, balance the, the seller's account. So this is what we owe to the seller. That's why even the balance brought down is on the credit side. Because on the credit okay. side, it means that we still owe the seller how much? Five million. It means that okay. is the liability that we are obliged to pay to, pay to the seller after completion. Okay. So 3.2, the answer is this one. It's five million. Okay, five million. Okay, got it. Understood. Yes. Mm. Okay, so that's everything for this paper. That's it. Perfect. Okay. Thank you I'm so also much, sir. Save for the future, maybe you will need it in future. I don't know. I can also send you these things just for the reference if you want. Yeah, that'll, that'll be nice, yes. But I do have, I did take it out. You, I'll have to you do have it. it. Okay, no problem. Let's, let me check. Let me check here. Let's check. Yeah.